I don't really know why I'm doing this this week. I've had an awful week. Max was really horrible to me because I pointed out that he was being stalked on the internet by that uppity faggot Toby. And you know what? You don't need to hear this. I'll just do the review. Um, so this week I watched The Boys in the Band, which is directed by William Friedkin, who did The French Connection and The Exorcist. Uh, it's based on a play. Um, so it all takes place in one room. Uh, it's about a birthday party for a gay man in Manhattan in 1970-something. And someone brings a hot hooker, and then a straight guy turns up, and, you know, it starts off kind of fun. They're all just drinking. They do a fun dance, and, you know, just being camp and silly. And then they get really shrill, and before you know it, they're making distressing phone calls, and they're all crying. Oh, my God, Jorge hated it. Oh, Jorge. You know, I think when I said I was going to watch a gay movie, he thought I meant porn. Or maybe Connie and Carla. Oh, not a bunch of self-loathing queens all turning on one another to see who had the most depressing psychological problem. I'm more pathetic than you are. He left after the movie. He, well, it, was meant, it was my dad's bingo night and everything. And, you know, he could have stayed, but... And he rang and said he still wants to see me, but... Oh, I think maybe he thinks if he becomes a full-time gay boy, he has to be all arch and camp all the time. <sighs> you know, we had the awful science fiction club meeting, and I don't know why that club doesn't even have a name yet. I mean, astronauts is perfectly acceptable. Stupid Toby and his stupid crush on Max. Anyway, I was talking about the film, not all this other crap. So, this straight guy turns up, and the main gay guy thinks that he's going to confess that he's gay. Um, and that he had an affair with this guy in college, but I'm so sorry. I shouldn't have done this today. I just, I was just at the shops and I saw Jorge. I mean, he didn't see me, but he was with his family and, you know, his kids were laughing and his wife was laughing. He had his arm around her and why does he keep telling me this stuff? Like, why... You know, I'm not the kind of person people fall in love with, you know? I'm not the kind of person people leave their children for. Like, he's been calling and just leaving messages. I can't talk to him. Like, I certainly can't listen to his messages in broken English. I just... I, mean, I should tell him why. I, I'm i sorry, this is stupid. Like, why... I shouldn't have done this. I'm, I need Judy. I'm, I'm going to watch The Wizard of Oz.